Good day folks, welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to share files and folders within Dropbox. So the first thing you need to do is go to dropbox.com and you will sign in with an email address and you will find yourself on this page. I'm in a folder currently. This folder's name is just up over here. And what we want to do is you can see that there are some files in here. Now let's say we want to share multiple files. We can go over and we can select these files. But for now, I'm just going to go ahead for example purposes and share this specific file. Over on the right hand side, there is a share icon and we're going to click on this. Now, as you can see, the name of the file is right at the top and you can choose who has access to this file. So we can go ahead and if there are more than one email addresses linked to this folder, we can go ahead and select who has access. If you go back from here, you can go ahead also now up to settings on the top right hand side. And here you have file settings and link for viewing. So the file settings is anyone with edit access can change these settings. So you can have this as the viewers info being shown or not. And then if you go to link for viewing here, you can create a link for people to actually view this specific file. We're going to go back now and what we can do is create a link and whoever is able to have access to this link will be able to access this file on this Dropbox account. So if you are adding names or email addresses here and you are tapping on share file, then those names and email addresses are the only people that will have access to this file. So it depends on what your specific needs are. If you want to do the exact same with a folder, as you can see here, I'm in this folder and at the top, you can see there's a share folder. Now, all of the same things apply. You can see over here, you can manage who has access, what kind of access they have. Over here, you can choose whether they have viewing access or editing access. And again, you are going to add email addresses or names here from your contact list and tap on share folder. This will allow only these people to have access to the entire folder and everything within the folder. You can also then just tap on create and you will be able to create a link and anybody with this link regardless of their name or email address here, will have access to this entire folder. You can now go ahead and share that link via email or any other method of your choice. If this was helpful, go ahead, drop us a like. We'll see you next time.